What is up YouTube? I got one quick video. It's just a little ricer mod. I got a tow hook. Right, so we're just gonna install this real quick. It should be less than five minutes. Um, I'm probably gonna add this onto another video. So you guys won't see this video until maybe next week when I upload. But yeah guys, this is a pretty simple install. Let's get to it. All right guys, so first you're gonna wanna get this part, get the bolt, one of the washers, and then save the other two washers for the opposite end. All right guys, so I just mocked it up real quick so I can show you guys what I did. Um, so like I said before, you need the, the bolt, the washer on one of the sides, you got the little metal bracket, and then um, you run them through the little, the stock tow hook or the, the little hook latch. Uh, you run one of the bolts through, the other one goes on the opposite side, and then uh, you get another washer to, come in between the, the actual hook itself, and then you put the nuts in the back and then you just tie them up. That's it. All right guys, so I already went ahead and tied it up. Like I said, guys, it's just a, you know, it took me less than five minutes to do it. Uh, I don't want this video to be that short. So like I said, I'm gonna add this video onto the other part when I installed the type bar lip and the, the new fog lights. So yeah, guys, see you guys when I get the other parts. Just want to give you guys a quick walk around before I end this video. Um, it looks kind of cool. Like I said, um, some people see this as ricey or like being a ricer, but I mean, it's not for everybody. I kind of think it looks cool, but I mean, you know, it is my car. You know, just do whatever you want to your car. As long as it makes you happy, that's all that matters. All right, what's up guys? Welcome back. You guys just fin watched me finish installing the tow hook in the back. So now we got this new type R lip or replica. I don't know, it's from eBay. So I guess it'd be considered a replica. But yeah, it's a new front lip for my 95 Honda Civic. And we're gonna get, the we're gonna get to installing this right now. All right guys, so down here under the car, we got one, two. We All right, so we got one right here on the, on the, on, on the side. We got three, four, five, six in the front. My car is missing some, so, but there should be a total of six because there's six holes there. Six and then the, the other one on the other side. So we're gonna, and these are all 10 millimeter bolts. So we're just gonna go ahead and take these out real quick. All right guys, so for some reason, there's an extra one here, right here. So it's this one and then the one on the back. So I guess each side is supposed to have two on the sides and then the six on the front. But for some reason, this one, this side didn't have it, so. Yep, just wanna let you guys know. All right guys, so once you're done taking all the bolts out, the lip should just pull right out. Or actually, no, look, I lied. I guess it is there. I didn't see it. All right, so there's two bolts on the sides and then six going across in the front. So this is right here, look at that. It was hiding. All right guys, so now it comes right off. Look at that, little tiny lip. All right, so we're just gonna put this side to side so we can compare the new one and the old one. All right, as you guys can see the difference, this is the stock one and the aftermarket one down here. This is way bigger compared to the stock one. It's like a little sliver. But yeah guys, so I'm gonna install this real quick and uh, I'll show you guys the the after once it's done. All right, just wanna give you guys a walk around with no lip. What do you guys think about this look? I personally don't like it, it looks kind of funny. But let me down, let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Is this something you guys would keep? Would you guys rock it like this? Let me know. All right guys, so the front lip came with its own little hardware, the little, their self tappers. And they came with a 3M double sided tape. So I'm guessing you can, uh, you know, use the 3M tape to just secure around just to make sure it's not flimsy. And then it does come with like its pre-drilled guidelines right here, right here. So I'm guessing that would just drill into here. And the bottom side too, it has a uh, one, it has like about four or five. And then right here on this side. So. I'm just gonna go ahead and drill onto them, drill drill onto the bumper, you know? It don't really matter, but yeah. All right guys, so this is the end result. 
Push that. Looks pretty dope compared to the stock one. It looks so sick. Uh, one issue I had was, um, well, not really an issue, but, uh, all right, so you see how I, I had the two soft tappers here? There's two here, two on the other side, and there's only three in the front. So there's one right here, right here, and right here in the middle. But um, the kit was missing one of the little tap-ons, so I just screwed on this one and this one, and the middle has no has no screw. You see? Oh, is it right? Right here, okay. So it's right here. And then that one, and this one right here. So those are the only two I put on, but I mean, it's still, it's pretty sturdy. I mean, it's not going anywhere, so yeah. Pretty sick. All right, so what do you guys think? Do you guys like the aftermarket front lip or do you guys like the stock one? I personally think this one looks so freaking cool. Makes the car look way aggressive, more aggressive than what it was. I mean, it's just a Honda, but still, I mean, can't go wrong with the aggressive look in the front. That looks so sick. So if you guys are interested in buying this front lip, I will leave the link for it in the description down below. Got it off of eBay. It cost me about 40 bucks, I think. 40 or 30. I'm not too sure. But yeah, guys, that's it for this video. It was just a quick install of the tow hook and the front lip. I do have some future videos coming soon. I'm going to be installing a new set of fog lights. These don't work. And I'm going to be replacing the fuel pump as well. I got a new fuel pump. Going to be replacing that. And if you guys, could, if you guys saw down here, you see these little drips of oil? Yeah, they're coming from the, the oil pan. So we're going to be replacing the oil pan gasket as well. That's, that's going to be a whole separate video. But yeah, guys, stay tuned. Thank you guys for watching. Leave a comment, like, subscribe. Peace.